Yo, what's going on, guys? Brody here, back on Madden 16. Just going to be doing a quick little lineup update video. Uh, it's going to be a quick one. <clears throat> I'm not going to be sure if I'm going to post another one tonight. Uh, there's not really much for me to do as of right now. I'm just going to check my chat. Okay, so there's a, there's a spot open in the league or as of right now if you guys want to join. So, yeah, just letting you guys know. And, yeah, I'm just going to do my little team. If you guys have any ideas of a video I'm going to do tonight, I'm kind of just like... Just grind it out, getting some coins so I can do some flashbacks. For uh, Wednesday, I kind of want to, if you're a YouTuber, you know, leave it in the comments. You can do a flashback battle. So, yeah, that's about it. So, I'm just going to show you my team. Mari Cooper catches balls. This man is amazing. I know you can already see his stats, but 94 speed, 92 catch. Yeah, I just throw it up to him, basically, in my league tournaments because I'm a complete noob. But I still score points. Jamal, eh, yeah. Meh, meh, meh. He can put the wiggles on people, and, you know, he's just not as fast as Jamal should be. He's only 92 speed, which, uh, don't get me wrong, it's fast, but, just, you know, Amari Cooper's faster. Like, you know, there's other running backs that are faster. For example, Jermail, if you're on a budget, 88 speed, 93 trucking, 86 agility, 85 elusiveness. Just all around perfect. So, like, I he might even play better for me. Ted Ginn is pretty good in this mad in the Madden Mobile. Because he's, you know, 95 speed. In console Madden, I've had the opportunity to play three draft, uh, draft, you know, drafts with him. I got really lucky. He is unstoppable with his speed. Those are just my offensive linemen. Uh, Jordan Cameron, I just got him for free. Solid tight end. Nothing too crazy. Uh, we'll go to my special teams. Bought him for 50K in the video you guys saw. That was very painful. Still on the hunt for a punter. They're 100K. I have never tried out Percy Harvin because obviously I've never been punted to unless I play seasons, but still, that's not really like that much of a tryout. You know, they barely ever punt because most of the time I get picks and stuff. But uh, yeah, so let's go to my defense. This is the pride and joy of my team because, you know, defense wins championships. Let's get it. Look at that. Oh, four flashbacks. I know, it's amazing. No, I'm, I'm just kidding, but yeah, that's obviously a lot better out there. I felt really dumb. I was like, oh my God. Brian Cushing gives me plus two strength. I got to get him. And then I read it. After I bought him, I was like, all right, let's check these stats out. Because I saw he was up for a good price. So I just bought it right away. I just had an instinct. Checked the stats out. I was like, nice. And then I looked at the bottom. It was like two Houston players. Dang. But I'll still take it. Still 91 overall middle linebacker. So he gives plus one awareness. So I like him. And he's pretty good. 85 speed. Uh, where? There we go. Arakpo. Solid. Solid. He's really good for rushing the passer if you like user him and then you can rush the passer with him. Uh Sue, solid, docket. I think I've already showed you guys his stats before in a different video, but those are his. And those are Jason Hatcher's. So yeah, I pulled all these guys, I think. But Jason Hatcher, I think I bought Jason Hatcher. The other ones I all pulled. Uh anyone else I want to show? Up? Malcolm Butler's pretty good player. Just all around. Like everything's pretty high. Nothing really too low besides even 70 tackles. Really good for a corner hook. Share some other corners. Let's see what they are. 57. So that's 13 more. Uh, he's probably pretty good tackle. Sean Smith, he's pretty big. 63. So that just shows you how good Malcolm Butler is tackling. So I like him. And yeah, I think that's about it for my team. Anything else I could show you guys? Uh, I pulled him in that signature pack opening, which kind of sucked. So yeah, I think that's about it. So if, if you're a YouTuber and you're interested in wagering me in a flashback, just leave it in the comments. So I'll play anybody of any amount of subscribers. As long as you post, you know, you, you're you not that person who has like one upload and it was like four months ago, but then says, subscribe to my channel and give me a shout out, but they don't even post. So like, if you post, just let me know and I'll, we're going to do a flashback wager on Wednesday. So yeah, that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys all for viewing all my videos, liking all my videos. If you like them, I don't know if you do. Subscribing to my channel. And then, yeah. Some birdie, and I'm out. Peace.